Last week, we finally put an end to the dreaded room boots grind. Now, I don't want to hear about those damn boots ever again on this channel. It was a meme for seven weeks, now it's over, alright? But at the end of that episode, we got a new grind. 80 crafting for the Amulet of Glory. So in this episode, we actually have a whole new grind going. Thank you all so incredibly much for 10,000 subscribers. If you haven't yet subscribed, do that right now if you enjoyed the series. Because next week's intro is going to be something goddamn special. Here's a little sneak peek. Got that bar money, I'm going back to my roots. Every bitch around the block is trying to love me for my boots. Like yeah, that's all you're getting. Hey, dude, can you please keep the cameras? You gotta be kidding me. Did you really just drop the camera in the river? Folan, did you drop the camera in the river? Hi, I'm Only Trails, and welcome to Season 2. Yeah! I've decided to make an account that can only train skills or do quests when it's required for a clue scroll. My goal is to get every unique reward from every tier of clue scroll. And later in the endgame, I want all the stats and all the items so I can complete every single monster clue. Currently, I'm on hard clues, but after I've completed 100, I will move on to elites. When I've done 50 elite clues, I'll move on to monsters. I might be a dumbass sometimes, but you'll learn to love it. Enough rambling, let's do some clues. Yes, this is what I was looking for. Catch me if you can. Now we can do the rat catcher quest, uh, which allows me to make stews. Um, and with those, I can boost up to a maximum of five uh, skill levels, uh, which will make future grinds way easier and could actually make this crafting grind doable. <laughs> so I only have to train to 75 crafting and uh, then I can boost up to the glory. I gotta wait for my kitten to grow in order to do rat catchers, because with a kitten, rat catchers is horrible, so I decided to dive into my alk tab, and here we go. That is 71 mage, really not that special of a milestone. There's still a lot to be alked, and we already have about 670k. I'm thinking I'll get about a mil, but it's good to have some spare cash, especially on this crafting grind and big grinds that are gonna come soon. Hey, there we go, while making some molten gloss, my kitten actually grew into a cat, now he's a big boy. And I'm ready to do rat catchers. And that is the second crafting level. 72 crafting right now. Not even close to 80. Uh, <laughs> we can now do dragonstone necklaces, was it? Was it? By the way, if you hear calming nature sounds in the background, it's because I'm playing another game. While I'm playing that game, I've just been AFK crafting for a little bit. And I've made 2.6k molten glass so far. Which is not even going to get me close to the 73 crafting. Well, it might get me close, but either way, I'm going to continue. Keep doing some crafting. So I also got 73 crafting, but I forgot to record my sound. I'm such a great YouTuber. Out of misery, I started making my gold bars into golden bracelets, because I'm AFKing anyway. Dragonstone bracelets unlock, though. Not gonna make that. But um, I think I'm going to make all my spare jewelry, or cuts and uncuts, into games necklaces, dueling rings, all that stuff. Because I have a bunch of cut gems. Look at that. 144, 56, 180, and 150 diamonds. Holy shit. 2,000 bracelets. What, do I, what are they worth? 700k in bracelets, alright. And this should be it. Rat catchers completed. Actually not too bad, people complain about this quest a little bit too much I feel like. But, I did run into some issues. Um, one, I thought I was actually going to be able to make spicy stews to boost my crafting up with 5 levels. That is not the case. I'll need the Evil Dave Recipe for Disaster subquest. Which I obviously haven't done, so I can't make those stews. Also, I can't make mushroom pies that boost my crafting 4 levels, because I'll need 75 woodcutting to get the mushroom things. Which means I will need 79 crafting to boost up to 80. So we unlock the music track, complete the medium clue, give me those boots! I think that might actually be a unique. It is not. Let's get back to crafting. I know this is not interesting every single time, but we got I've been crafting for like three days straight now. We're able to make red DI chaps and sleigh rings now. Oh, sleigh rings, not too bad, to be honest. We have the points for that. Um, I've made 3,583 lantern lenses so far. Still got 2,700 molten, molten... Still got 2,706 molten glass left, which will probably grant me another level. And then I'm gonna have to go back to the charters. 76 crafting, 77 crafting, 78 crafting. All right, here we go, moment of truth. One week in the making, 80, no, 79 crafting, but we can boost up to 80 now. We can make black dehyde van braces, not too bad. I don't think we even have that. Let's finish up this inventory. Let's get that boost, the poison chalice, and make that glory and complete the clue. I've been working on this for a whole week, that's why this episode was late, and I apologize for that. I also decided to make all my games necklaces and dueling rings, so I have 143 games necklaces and 56 rings of dueling now, which is going to last me for quite a while, I think. <laughs> Alright, running through the furnace, let's make these dragon stones first, and then hope we get the crafting boost first time, we got five poison chalices here, boom. That is not crafting, what did that even boost? Nope, that's 
thieving again or something else that I'm not seeing. A little strange. That's 80 crafting. Quick, quick. Put it in. Make the glories. One, two. Not done yet. Not done yet. Can't drop down. Boom. We got a Dragonstone amulet. Here we go. Let's get that glory going. Boom. Glory number one and glory number two. We still have to charge them, but I don't think I need to charge them for the clue, though. Ring of Life. Am uncharged amulet of glory. Okay, that's important, apparently. And the Cat Doored Pyramid and Sophonim. All right. I'll see you guys there. All right, let's do this. Moment of truth. I think this is only step one. Oh, no, it's four. It might actually be the casket. I didn't even realize. And... It is! Holy shit! Alright, that's a good start. That's a good start. First casket of the episode. First casket in weeks for me. Let's do this. That's freaking amazing! Um, I think the Rune Blade Links G and the Tan Cavalier are goddamn unique. But holy shit, that Tan Cavalier is sick! That's actually sick. Let's quickly check that out. Whether the Plate Legs are also a unique. Come on, baby. Yes! We only need to play buddy and we got a room full G. Full rune G. That's how it works. And the kite shield. The kite shield is also something we need. Still looking for that H3 helmet, cause... I don't want to drop too many clues. And now there's just one thing left to do. Get all of these hard clues out of the way, so we can do elites. Let's grind them out. Alright, here we go. Casket number... 64. Which means only 36 left. Let's do this. Boom! Guys. Say it with me. Trash! We got another clue scroll casket. One, two, hey, yo. Gnome Coach is supporting us. Uh, Torture Corva is just running away in the distance for some reason. Let's go, third age, easy. <gasps> yes! Two room blade bodies, I'm kidding. Guthic's Dehyde Boots. Yo, we're getting so lucky on these blessed Dehyde Boots, lads. Holy shit. Those look like Ranger Boots, but they're even more beautiful. Oh my god, that's not even too bad. Let's go. There we go. Casket number 66, I think. There's only one thing I want, actually, and that is the Gilded Boots. Oh, Zami Page, not too bad. Actually, it's, it's not too bad, but I'm just hunting for unique, so this is not gonna cut it. Only 33 more to go after this one, and then we're straight onto elites, guys. That's. You know, I tend not to complain about law runes, but I don't like this at all. Woof, the. Oh, is that right? Rogue top. I don't think I need that. Anyways, we're gonna get the casket here. Boom, get that. Maybe just run out real quick before I get PK'd or anything like that. Or before these bandits slaughtered the shit out of me. But this is clue number... I'm not even sure. I think it's 69. Don't make a joke about it. I won't do it. You guys are not gonna do it. You know what? Because it's lucky. And because I'm gonna get the third age... Kite Shield. Damn it. Oh, good alcables though. I'm not gonna complain about this clue. This clue is decent. A couple sharks, kite shield, and double play body. That's good alcables. You know what? Almost on 70. Almost ready to go. <sighs> clue scroll number 70. A beautiful number. I want I just want a clue over 70k. You know what? I'll take it. Only 29 caskets to go after this one. Casket number 71 is trash. Boys, we're coming so close. Casket number 72. Oh, that is a beautiful new unique. You guys are probably tired of me saying the word unique, but another skirt. I think we got all of them almost. I think we do. Wait, hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see if the Saradoman page is unique. Probably not. No, because we have the whole book like a thousand times. Are y'all ready, kids? All right, I'm never going to do that again. Oh my God. Nope. Now there's only one thing I want. To finish this whole thing up. We've done about 15 clues, if not more. But this is the one. There we go. You know, it, it actually is trash, but I need the Morton Teleport. So I will take this one. God damn it. Only 24 more to go. This is cost number 76. We're getting closer and closer to these elite... We're getting closer to these elite clues. Let's get that third age. Yo, these clues have been absolute trash over and over again. But there's decent alks, I mean, come on, can't complain that much. Yes, I'm complaining. I'm complaining. A lot. Clue scroll number 77, I think. Maybe 78. I'm not sure. But it is a unique... Yes, it's not really the one I want. But you know what? I'll take it. I love Zamorak. The red is absolutely beautiful. Let's get it. Casket number 78. I've gotten one unique in five clues. It is about time I get that beautiful... Room plate lays G, that is something I already have. I'm not 100% sure, let's check it out, but I'm about 98.6% sure. Yeah, that is just, uh, that's just saddening. That is just, that makes me 
a little bit sad. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. I know it's a little bit short. I'm trying my best to push these out as weekly as I can. As you know, I upload every Wednesday. I still get a lot of PMs in game asking when I'm uploading. So on that note, every single Wednesday, my dudes. And then I'll try to put some other videos in between. We got something to look forward to, guys. And 0.5% girls. Yes, we dropped down. Hopefully next week, we'll do our first Elite Clue. See you then.